All right, out here checking trap line. Got me my first badger. And he is not happy. Look at the damage he did right here. That is insane. I've been trapping since 2006, and this is my first badger. I'm pretty excited. All right, we're going to get him dispatched here. That's like a four foot hole. All right. He's dispatched. I can't believe this. Right here on the corner. I'm just in awe. I can't believe it. There he is. Or she, I should say. I mean, this is a huge, huge badger. I am absolutely tickled. What an experience. All right, time to go check the rest of the trap line. Just a beautiful prime fur. This one's gonna get mounted. All right, well, I'm on cloud nine already with getting that badger this morning. I'm tickled, I've been trapping a long time here in Michigan and that's never happened and it's really cool to set up on that sandy area. I, I set it for fox or coyote um, but the landowner told me there's badger in the area but yeah I'm, I'm tickled. It, it worked out perfect. That's actually why I set that trap centered. I didn't set it off to the left a little bit or to the right a little bit like normally do. I set that trap centered. And it really paid off and I'm going through here checking traps now and uh, walk up on this I got me a huge mink and a jumbo rat I'm guessing probably got the rat first the mink come in and got it on the second set that's why I do a lot of these sets doubles so the wraps, the rat set was right here on this hole. There's a little tunnel that comes up over through here. And you can see my stake right there. I had the other one right there. So he was, man, that's a good body catch on him. He was coming from that way. So yeah, I bet you he came up here, checked out this rat. Lucky he didn't eat on it any. Went right up into here and got this and was going to come up behind him, I bet. Wow, this is a great day in the trapping woods. Absolutely beautiful out. Can't believe it's December. Alright, let's keep going. Get these cleared out and keep on moving. That is... The second mink out of this trap, and the third one total since I've been trapping here. And this is um, just after the main deer season here in Michigan, and wanted to stay out of here for that and let the pelts get a little more prime. Uh, a lot of people don't know, but the pelts get prime by the daylight, not how much snow or how cold it is. So December is a great time to start trapping. Plus, you don't have to worry about messing up anybody's deer hunts. So I just got started with this and I've only been trapping, I think today is day six or seven and I've got a almost 60 pound beaver, a badger, 
three mink, seven muskrat, a coon, and two possum. So, not too bad for this little area. Not too bad. With the gas prices being they are and fur prices not being worth anything, what I'm doing is I'm trapping my spot by spot. I'm going to be seven, eight days in one area, move to the next spot. That way I'm not driving all over Timbuktu. So that's my strategy this year. So I'm setting a lot of traps heavy through here, coming into an area, kind of cleaning it out and moving to the next spot. And then I'll just end up closer to home is what the plan is. That way when it's really bad weather, I'm close to home and easy checks. All right. Just set a dirt hole set right here. Got this lane here, so the next step they have to take over is close to the trap. And I got 330 there, 330 there, 330 there. Couple more 330s. This little beaver dam right here. I already got one out of here and I haven't seen any new sign. I haven't seen much going on, but I'm going to give it two more days out here. Let's see, if I don't get nothing, I'll think I got them out of here. Alright, let's go to the next set. Well, just pulled this small mink out of this trap set right here. That trap's frozen in. Second mink of the day, fourth of the season. Well, looks like I caught me a rabbit. Something ain't good last night. I'm going to reset this and see what happens. Alright, well, got a possum in my dirt hole set. And... Going. Another possum. Jeez, oh Friday. This is possum central, man. <laughs> 